up guys out here with my super messy hair just got done building this kx100 woods bike for katie she's been complaining about the suspension and how heavy that klx 140l was and it was heavy it was as heavy as my bike almost <laughs> This one is 150 pounds and she's dropped it a couple times and already picked it up herself. So my job got easier, but unfortunately for weight and suspension, she had to give up electric start. So I know she's not super happy about that. Yeah, dude. Woo! <laughs> but she's ripping around pretty good on it. She's starting to get comfortable. So I'm super excited about it. Let me rip around once. No, you go ahead. Keep right. Keep right. Go. I think you should. Okay, let me try it once. Okay. Anyway, what was I saying? So the KLX, you know, it's a great bike, super reliable, easy to learn on, easy to ride. But once you start getting into technical stuff and there's rocks and stuff, the suspension is terrible. There's not a whole lot you could do to them. At least the KX, while it's suspended for track, you know, it's one of the softer suspensions and it really, it converts the trail pretty easily, I think. I put five weight fork oil in to soften them up a little bit and I got them, the clickers adjusted to about stock with five weight and it, it seems to soak up things pretty good it's not a perfect enduro suspension but it beats what the klx 140 offered which wasn't wasn't very much Okay, so today we had a, I got a new bike, uh, it's a two-stroke, and I haven't had one since like 2017, 2018. What was it? Uh, red? What color was it? Green? Blue. Orange. It was, ew. Actually, sorry y'all for, for the people that have orange, orange bikes. Ew. Um, ew, KTMs are gross. I know. My bike's cooler than all of yours. Sorry to flex. I don't know about but, that, but go ahead. Oh my god. So, just kind of playing around, like doing loops, getting more comfortable with everything. Um, yeah. It's a Kawasaki KX100, right? Uh, pretty nice. I like it. It's a lot taller for me. And the thing with my last bike was that it was way too short. And I liked his bike better because it was a lot taller and I could stand up more comfortably. But now I have a new uh, racing bike. I can tell it already goes a lot faster, but I have a, what is it called? What do you mean? The neutral, not neutral. Oh, you have a recluse. Yeah, I have a recluse uh, thing so like my bike can't stall. And that was really weird at first, but I think I'm slowly kind of getting used to it. Like right now, the bike was really nice to, you know, just get the hang of because when I first did it, it was really weird because I didn't really understand the whole recluse thing. Tell me about how you ran over your foot. <laughs> so we put the recluse in, right? We put the recluse in, and I'm trying to explain to Katie, who is terrible at listening to me. Oh, okay, never her. mind. I got it. No, right, no, got no. I it? talk. Okay. <laughs> okay, so a few days ago, um, <laughs> he was fixing my bike and he was explaining to me how, like, the recluse works. I didn't pay attention because I'm more like just like looking at the bike, seeing, like, seeing how it looks, you know, new designs. And he starts it up and I'm thinking it's on uh, neutral because he didn't have his hand on the uh, clutch. So he just, like, kept going. So I, 
So I like throttled. Yeah, I throttled the gas, and it just went like <laughs> it just like like fell over, landed on my ankle. Was it helpful? Scratched me up pretty good. It drove over you. It literally drove over me. Yeah, yeah basically. What noise did it make? Bram! <laughs> <laughs> All over your foot. Uh, kind of hurt. That was glorious. Yeah, glorious for him. Um, not glorious for me though. I'm not trying to have a bunch of trauma attached to this bike before exactly. you even ride. I already have so much trauma from <laughs> last time we rode. Yeah, show me your scar. My my cool scar. I'm not sure if you can see it on camera or not. But I'll throw a little picture in there. <laughs> oh right. Bam. <laughs> picture. <laughs> picture. I have some like PTSD from it, and I was like a little nervous coming out, but like. Slowly, I just kind of got better, and I just, I think the camera went to turns on. I'm really, I'm a lot better at standing up because I'm more confident and want to look good. Yeah, for sure. And that yeah. just slowly makes me better. It's okay. It's okay. Seldom do we get good for ourselves. We want to get good to impress other people. Right. Right. So. Yeah.